Yo, what is going on, everybody? It's your boy, Drop the Gamer here, welcoming you back to another episode of the Saga Log. It is super weird recording because I haven't done this in a couple days. Um, but holy Toledo, Batman, we had an episode. Y'all didn't vote for the Choose My Starter, and I don't know why you guys didn't. You left Joy to make the decision, but Joy picked the thing I wanted, so it's okay. I'm happy because you know, if you guys just wanted to let Joy pick, that's fine. You know, you can do that, but. Scary things will happen if you continue to let that happen. So make sure that whenever you see the little thinking emoji that you vote on what you guys want. Because I'll most likely be asking you a question. A um, little bit of reiteration is we have a couple new people in there. Um, but because of the fact that, you know, we got the Pokemon we wanted to get. This is our Pokemon. We have Bollywood. Um, and, uh, you know, there's a reason for that. Uh, with the docile nature, multi-scale, final gambit. Smog, Toxic, and Poison Sting. Honestly, decent moveset. Level 11, pretty nice. That confirms to me that I did the right thing when I did the uh, changes because I wanted to make um, it 5% higher for these Pokemon so that way I could actually like reliably use them. So that's correct. It actually did move up the level that it was supposed to because it was 10.5. So positivity, good things going. So this is 209. Honestly, I'm excited for what's going to happen. Um, today I'm going to be recording with Joy and hanging out with Joy, so I'm already uber excited about that. Like, of course, any opportunity to hang out with Joy just means, like, extra excitement and added happiness for the day. Like, happiness meter just gets full. Also, I cannot see how much money I have. Gosh, dang it. I... It looks like I... I yeah, I can't even see. Well, I guess that's because I'm looking at the screen with Joy. Um... Because I'm so happy to be with, like, hang out with Joy that I'm, like, kind of pseudo expecting that, of course, naturally while I'm, uh, recording that it'll pop up and be like, ah ha 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 ha. And then it'll be like, this is, this is actually what the case is. And be like, oh, okay. The screen's a little off. I caught, I, I caught that because I was like, this is not the right thing. Okay, there we go. Coolio. So, we have $2,199, which, funny that we have an ending in 99. So, I... I think that I have stuff that I can sell, actually. Don't I have, like, a star piece or something crazy like that? Of course, we're keeping the fossil. Rocky helmet is funny. Oh, we that's right. He was holding a rare bone. That, I was like, I was like, what happened? Yeah, no, uh, yeah. I, um, that, so because I was holding a rare bone, I was like, yeah, we're selling that. Like, we don't need it. There's nothing that we can utilize for it, so why not? Kind of an ordeal. <clears throat> Um, although we cannot buy super potions yet, can we? We can. We have, oh, we have 10 in a bag. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. I'm overstressing for no reason. Almost like it's an everyday affair. So, not surprised that that's what's going on. But, uh, what do we have as far as Pokeballs and stuff? 13, 1. Oh, we don't have, like, Great Balls? Oh, boy. Do I want to spend my money on that, though? Yes. Yes, I do. Um, I'm going to buy, like, five or five of them i think that's a safe number because you know we just got we got we spent like half the money that we got from the rare bone on great balls it makes sense we're gonna get an encounter anyway so it does make the absolute sense but let's go ahead and talk to shy soul because it's been a hot minute since we have to talk to shy soul and you know that's a definitely a big thing hi joy speaking of joy could you come in the cafe we need to get some tea well, can I get coffee? You can have tea, but I can. Can I have coffee? Like, it's okay. I'm shy, so blah, 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 blah. I, I, I'm saying blah, 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 because we've read this before, and it's the same text. So, like, it's totally okay. Um, I really do wish that I turned on fastest text. Um, so, because if I would have turned on fastest text, then we wouldn't, like, I could just blah, 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 blah. But then again, does fastest text actually break? Je the J Gen 6 and 7 games. It might. It Honestly, it could. There's a good possibility. Uh, because things break games and it's kind of annoying when it happens. So, but no, it was actually funny. So, actually, speaking of Shy Soul, so Shy Soul is part of the Fortune Street community, which is the Fortune. This is why this is Fortune Avenue. Um, but Gifty actually is another person in the Fortune Street community. And he is actually doing this game currently in a randomized format 
for the first time you trying a randomized game because if you guys did not know on Sunday I did a sleep block. It was kind of crazy. It was 21 hours. It was it was a fun day though, like all in all. Like there was there was things that happened, but it, all in all it was a fun day. And so with that being said, I'm really excited to see where his run progresses and he'll be able to kind of gauge and see where my run progresses too and how bad or good my run turns out because it is one of the that, that is one of those where it's like it go these runs can go great fantastic splendid or they can go trash and be absolutely horrific so and you never know until you start but hi uh, mr lucario my goodness i need to get a watch me get like a I feel like I'm gonna get a good. I'm like I'm, I'm just. I still am. I'm a shiny fiend right now. Like I'm in shiny mode. I want a shiny really, really bad. Um, because it's been super long. Like we haven't got one in Soglock at all. That's that's something that's something to state. Like in the entirety of Soglock, especially the fact that I a lot of this game I've been just regularly training, right? Because. I know that, and I've admitted to some like having to do rare candy stuff, which is annoying, and I hate it. Because um, I admitted to that with uh, Heart Gold and Silver, uh, because I had to do that a lot there, and I was like, Ugh. I was getting actually very frustrated with having to do it that way. Because I prefer, I I know pe people think I'm weird for it. Um, I've had a bunch of people actually be like, you do that, like why? Oh my God, we got both stars. <laughs> people do think I'm weird for it though that I actually, like, take the time out of my day to actually do the leveling up via the wild battles. Okay. But, I mean, I don't think it's weird. I think it's actually, like, a, more of a testament to what I will let myself do. What I'll do. Oh, boy. Because that way you guys just know, like, off the rip and off the get-go that hey I will be the one putting in the work I don't have a problem putting in work like that's just not something that I really see being a big point of contention because it's like what's the, what's the point of being worried about putting in the work for something that you want to do in the first place I don't know I don't see why that would be an issue but Things that some people do. Oh, you turned me into a fighting type. Let me go ahead and I'm gonna hit you with a shadow sneak then. Um, just because that'll get my last bit of chip damage that I need, and then I'll go ahead and go for it. Ooh, okay. See, I like that Naruto's defensive, right? Because I, I looked at that and was like, oh, that's gonna be a dangerous hit. And it's like, wait, you're using Naruto, and Naruto literally is super good at taking hits. So, best book one to use in the circumstance is Naruto. So, but yeah, I mean, we're getting. What do I even name this? Like, I'm gonna be 100% honest, I have no clue what to name this thing. Because it's not like... Oh wait, I'm silly. I have a mom that can put things to sleep. Because I didn't do a team recap. Because I'm, oh silly, we'll really go. Um... Yeah, why, why am I not in my Pokemon that can uh, put things to sleep? I mean, I guess technically I did need a little bit of time to actually, like, get this Pokemon set up to go to sleep. Uh, because Wake Up Slap's not going to do much. It's going to be, like, five. Oh, my gosh. That did 12. Hello. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Oh, that's a even more scary move. Go to sleep. Um, you do not take hits at all, apparently. That's great news. Great news to know, but I really kind of wish I didn't know. Watch, he's gonna wake up instantaneously. Good, he did it! He actually did good and stayed asleep. Uh, but I'm gonna Great Ball it. I, I wanna catch this thing. This thing's a good Pokemon to have, considering that not this episode, but the episode after is a kill episode, so like I definitely need something for it. Uh, but I mean, I have a thought process and a plan in mind, but team diversity, always a good thing. Uh, like, honestly, I like having a bunch of different types on my team. Like, the amount of, like, fire or other types. Like, this is a weird team assortment, and I do not know how to feel about it. But we got it. I don't know what to name this thing, though. What what do we name this thing? I'm going to name it...
Gonna name it Kim. Kim the Concalver. Honestly, feel it. I feel like it's a good name for it. <laughs> I don't know. It just that that's the first thing that came to mind. So I was like, we're going for it. Oh my gosh, this is actually like an actual real problem. Okay. I wasn't expecting it to be a real issue or a real problem, but yet it actually is. Because um, during the sleep block, we were having issues with uh, controller functionality, right? And, you know, that makes sense because, you know, controller functionality likes to be funny sometimes. But, but no, it actually straight up is going to be a butt fadoongle, and I don't like that. Maybe I fixed it. Oh my gosh, did I? I swear, if this is the fix that I was looking for the entire time, I'm going to kind of be upset. If I just figured out what the problem was in like two minutes, or like the second by the second time and so that happens in Soglog, but I couldn't figure it out for a whole like 18 hours, 20 hour stream, that, that, that will be kind of, that will be extremely infuriating. Although... The buttons. Do they not have that feature in this game? Do I actually have to manually hit the switch button? Because I want a Dino out in front. Like, okay, I guess I had to manually do it. That's weird. That's super weird. Like, why do I have to manually do it? Like, I'm not saying that, like, as it's... As, uh... Not as criticism, but like, I'm not saying that because of the fact that I hit the working, but it's more like, um, it's more like a what the heck kind of moment. Also, um, should we use Dizzy Punch for the first time? I think we should. It's a, it's a seismic mode. Like, we might as well try and confuse it. Wow. Okay, wait, actually. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. We just murdered. We just did it. We did the goods. We did the goods. We did the goods. We did the goods. 100% just did the goods. Doesn't affect Dino, but it kills both the other ones. Woohoo! Uh, Naruto! Naruto! Look at look at you go. Honestly, um I just kind of revealed something that I unintentionally that might just get one of these two killed. Because um that 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 just kind of makes double bottles up. A bit of a something. Okay. I mean, I'm not opposed to it. Oh, speaking of, oh hi Siren, you want to learn muddy learn muddy water? Uh, what is muddy water's accuracy? Isn't it like 90, 85? Yeah, no, no girl, you're not learning muddy water. Keep old moose. So, Siren, you guys might be asking the question of why is Siren? Why did you not choose to evolve Siren? Because I learned that Siren. Oh wait. No, what does Mist do? Red stats being lowered for five turns? Not a bad ability, but not bad, but I'm not going to do it. Um, because Siren actually did level up holding the dragon scale, which is her evolutionary requirement. So why didn't she get the opportunity? Well, I decided I was going to play it the way that the game wanted to have played. So because she did not evolve, she will not be evolved yes that's odd but also too the, another reason that she's not gonna evolve is for content purposes because that that moment right there actually proves something in a pokemon game that we did not know beforehand it also further proves that pokemon needs to work on their crudoli because um apparently there's an extra check step that we never knew about so Yes, we're keeping her that way because she, she did not evolve within the game. That's pretty pretty easy to say, at least. Um, and, you know, I, I know I evolved a Mr. Mime at a certain level, but that's because I it was not set up correctly. This is set up correctly, so there's a difference. The difference is, one, I messed up, and this other one, the game decided to mess up. So, sorry, Siren, but you're saying what you are. Um... And honestly, it affects me kind of because it's like I can't, I can still pickpocket things, but I also can't take special hits to save my life. So it's like they bo both of them had positives and negatives to them. 
So because, because I looked up, I looked into it, made sure that I did it everything correctly, and I did. So, but because both sets had their separate positives and negatives, I figured we'll just keep it the way that this game had it. I mean, I think if it was all negatives, I would have kept uh, my Pokemon. I would have evolved it because it's me, and if I can make it harder, I will. But because it literally, like, technically, like, it, they both, like I said, it, they're both difficult for different reasons, and it's Okay, and then my thought process was also, like, how long is girl going to be alive anyway? So, because girl's been looking out, like, a lot lately, okay? Like, 100% has been just completely lucking things out of nowhere. It's just like, okay. Ah, the buttons. What, like... Okay, what is wrong with the button situation? Because, like I said, it's just going straight to that. And I don't know why. Like, what's causing that? At least I got the other thing out of the way. Is there, like, an extra button that's supposed not set that's supposed to be set or something? Quite frankly, I'm not sure, but... Huh. That did nothing. In a 6v6 against Carp. I'm actually surprised with how little damage that did. I mean, it is... A, it, we are talking about a uh, Confusion Cat, though. Like, I mean, I guess if we're being honest, we're talking about a Pokemon that should not be doing a bunch of damage anyways. But, is there an item that paralyzes you? I know that's, okay, that is like the dumbest question I think I've said ever, but I'm like, it's actually a genuine question because is the, if there's something that paralyzes you, that actually could be beneficial. Oh, we're sending out magic? Okay, then. Um, magic is a Gyarados. Do, we don't have anything for that. We don't have anything really for that. Hmm. Actually, wait a minute. It's a physical attacker. Hold on. I'm overcomplicating things per usual. Why? Well, I'm not surprised that I'm overcomplicating things, but we have this thing called Soaking Giga Drain. So as long as it doesn't hit us with anything big or major, we'll be okay. Rain Dance. <laughs> Rain Dance. I'm gonna Giga Drain on it. That's fine. We're okay. We're chill. We're big chill. We're big chill. Uh, oh my gosh, it lived. Oh, we. <laughs> Magic, no. You don't. Don't do that. You don't want to pull that, my buddy. I I love you too. But like, if you loved me, you'd actually join one of my teams for once. Cause that's another thing. We've like yet to have a Magic Cherry Wave. Well, that's an easy kill. That's what we call easy claps. Dino, take care of it. Take care of business, buddy. You got it. I can literally pick whatever move I want, and it murders this Cherubi. So, uh, returning to the subject at hand. Honestly, I've been having a lot of fun with this. The emulator and the stuff that I'm running this on is being jank as all can be. Which is, like, that is the frustrating thing. It's like, the fact that it, it's decided it wants to go to jank mode. Tentacle. And so, with it going to jank mode, it makes me think, hmm, how can things be done? What things do I need to do to handle the situation? And I don't know. And that, I guess that 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 statement in, in it of itself is the frustrating thing. Is I don't know how to fix it or mess with it. And nor do I really have the ability to look into it either. So... It's just, a, it's just a tough spot to be in as somebody who likes to be perfect and fix things. Hi, Mew. Oh, my gosh. Okay. So, yeah. So, because I want to fix things and make things better, it's like, how do I manage that? Or what can I do to manage that? And, you know, you never know. So, we'll, we'll figure it out, I'm sure, over time. Uh, but considering we have two games in this format, and this, it's like, 
I need it to get fixed fast because if it's not, it'll make me mad. Also, can Jolly Roger stop missing freaking Frost Breath? That is his third Frost Breath that he's missed in a row, guys. Three in a row. It's 90% accurate. You should not be missing that at all. You should not be getting burned by Ember. You should not be missing this 90% accurate move four times in a row. Jolly Roger, you're supposed to make me happy. You're the Jolly Roger. You're not the Pissy Roger, because if you were the Pissy Roger, pissing me off would make sense. But you're the Jolly Roger. You're supposed to make me happy. Oh, Jolly Roger. Like, you are annoying. For, the, for a mod that's supposed to make me happy, like, you are a Pokemon that just... Ooh, ooh, ooh. You give me the Rage Candy Bars. It's like... I send you out because I know you're going to tank special hits, right? Like, that's your purpose. So, I mean, it's hitting me with Ember because it's super effective. But, like... I use a critting move that's 90% accurate for this reason, by the way, because it lived on one. And it's just like, it's like, bruh, come on. Do better. Be better, okay? That's, that's all I can ask of you is to be better and do better. But. Remember two months to learn the lava plume? Weird. It's better than Sandtomb in this case, I think. I mean, Sandtomb is physical. But Lava Plume is... Oh, yeah. No, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I, I don't... I, I don't... I realistically do not see myself using... The Lava... Or, um... The Tomb moves. But I could see myself staying out on a ground... Or a... a gra or a bug type. And then having something to hit it with. A Kyogre. Are we kidding? Is this real? Why is it a Kyogre for one? Dang it, Siren, you're coming in again. What the heck? If it's Primal. I don't think Primals exist yet, actually. Me. If it's Primal, I'm gonna be upset. John, Primals don't exist, buddy. But good try, anyways. Um, jeez, Kyogre. Rain Dance. Oh my gosh, why does Carter why does Carter's or Carp's entire team literally have freaking rain dance like what is what is the purpose of that like why is it funny like what your entire team just sets up rain and then uses like a small move that did a lot because it's a kyogre but still it's like buddy buddy do we do this why why do we why do we do this to each other we just need to be happy with each other and then everything everything will be better okay siren is level 20 Oh, also, uh, I just realized that I, hadn't I learned to move? Oh, okay. That was something that I don't know why it didn't recognize, but, yep, that's... Oh my gosh, S-Meister! Look at that! You actually won! Yeah, I know I did, Trev. I know, Jonas, I won because it's me, okay? Thanks for the honey, by the way, because now I can actually select my encounters that I want. Honey is awesome, but I only can use what the game gives me, so I can't just, like, go get I think that's only fair. Another Mega Stone. Okay. I mean, we're clearly gonna get Megas. That's clearly... The game is just like, yeah, so by the way, there's a bunch of different Megas you can get, and you're definitely gonna get one at some point. And I just, I'm like, thank you, game. I'm happy with you right now. Isn't there a TM upcoming somewhere? I think there's a TM upcoming somewhere. Okay, if I go this way, I'm forced to fight that trainer. Is that how that works? <gasps> oh my gosh! It's you again! Uh, you're amazing! Uh, oh my gosh, okay, game. I You ruined my moment with this Pokemon. I can't believe you. You had to ruin my moment. Are you kidding me, game? Stupid A button. Tricks are for kids. Did you not know that? Freaking don't mess with my... You know what, okay? Oh 
Oh my god, if you actually like Metrodome Pear Song or something like that, Ice you in nice. <clears throat> you cannot be messing with her. Oh my goodness. As I I need the experience, okay? In more ways than one. Thank you. Dino out here, level 22. Jeez. Dino wants to learn trick. No, Dino. You get treats, not tricks. I feel like Dino, like, if Dino ever met me, that could be, that could be something that goes, like, really wrong because of how, uh, how treat heavy I feel like I'd be. I'd be like, I mean, not really, because obviously it's like Joy's bird, so, like, Joy makes the rules, but I'd be like, Dino, you're so cute, oh my gosh. And I'd be like, I love him so much. This Joy's be like, oh my gosh. We're playing hand and foot, and Dino just freaking, uh, goes on the table and messes with the cards. I'd be like, oh my gosh, Dino. Oh, <laughs> um, actually, there's a funny story that goes along with this. Like, I just brought it up as a hypothetical and realized wait a minute, that's technically something that's happened before. So my next door neighbor has a bird, right? or had a bird, and um, her bird would like go get up on the table because I mean it was a cockatoo, so it liked to get in the middle of everything, which I mean makes sense. Okay. It, it liked people when it wanted to like people. She had two, um, and one of them was actually like really, really, really nice. Uh, but the one I'm talking about was very destructive, but also nice at the same time. So, um, anyways, he would end up like getting on the table, right? And with, while we're playing hand and foot, and mess, because we, we had to, we'd have to keep him off, either off the table. Or, um, or we'd have to keep it on, uh, or keep him on her shoulder or my next door neighbor's. Because otherwise, he would just get off the table, thanks for heal powder, or get on the table and just, like, start eating the cards. And it's like, buddy. So we always call it the Niner card because, um, now, mind you, my next door neighbor did not name this bird. My next door neighbor got the bird, uh, named as is. So it was 49er. But, um,. With that being said, it was one of those, like, situations where it was like, okay, so there's a, a six of, like, I think it's a six of diamonds, right? And the six of diamonds is always going to be forever called the Niner card because we know what card it is because we weren't paying attention to him when he went on the table. And he was biting a chunk of that card. So it's like, you have all three sides and then you just have the left corner that just does not have anything. Um, and I could go on card tangents for a long time because it's me and we know that. But um, I think getting to this plot is a good spot to stop as we're at the 28 minute mark and we're in a new town. And so next episode, oh no, wait a minute. I just realized, no, 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 no. no. <sighs> next episode is the 12v12. Uh oh. Next episode, the 12v12. Next episode, the 12v12. It's good, but bad, but also, oof, I'm gonna get destroyed by... <laughs>